Welcome back. Um, I was looking at mead sweet leaves and flowers. I can't see anything that distinguishes between them. It did say they need to be boiled, which it also said um, if I pay closer attention to my herb lore when boiled. So I'm going to have to bring my. Do I have a fine pot, I think? Pots are pots. Uh, they make no difference in the outcome, I believe, is what Sammy has said. But I might as well bring a fine pot as a regular pot. Um, I think I'm going to bring the elk fur. And... I might actually want to fish and My axes outside? Where are my axes? I didn't think I left them outside, but I didn't see them all there, but maybe I didn't look closely enough. We have I don't see any of my axes here other than the carving axe. Splitting Woodsman and um, Broad is Oh, there they are. Yeah, sorry, I put them with that. Okay, so let's bring just to give us something to do while we while we recover. Let's try to give these Nurepes a wide berth. Without being ridiculous about it. Okay, one of my injuries has fully healed. And, yeah, the one to my right knee was just 1%. That was the very first injury. I'm like, well, he got me, but we're going to mop him up now. And it didn't quite go that way. So, that means we can apply, uh, do the physician thing again. We're doing two kilometers an hour instead of the one we were doing. And oh, we even brought the boards. Okay, good. So we can collect some stones. But I guess first. And we even have a couple of slender trunks. Um, let's 
feed the dog. Or do you want to build our fire? Here. Looks like a good place for a fire. Not adjacent to anything that's going to burn. And we'll put our cooking stone here. And it's not draining, but that's okay. find it. I probably missed the eat cell phone message while I was, had my back turned. Looks like you found it. So boiling. Let's see if we can figure out how to boil something. I think in order to boil something you probably need a pot and you probably need some water in that pot. And you probably need a fire. I wonder if my injury affects my chance to make a fire. Okay. He's barking at that bird again. And everything we need. Cookery, boil. I, I guess I'll start with the leaves. I needed to bring more pots than just the one. Oh, it looks like the leaves just give you a beverage. So it's the flowers that you need to boil in order to do your physician stuff. Hmm. Yeah, the beverage is okay. So the use the leaves if you get poisoned, but I think it said if you get seriously poisoned. I guess if you eat rotten food, this is a good thing to to have. But why would you eat rotten food? I guess we all do accidentally sometimes. We just go to eat and we don't notice it's so spoiled. Uh, speaking of which, he's. Roasted cuts have been heroic at not going off. Ooh. Excuse me. Is this done yet? No. Um, so we'll go collect. First of all, we'll let you see how things look now. shoulder is the worst one because it's not healing as quickly as the left calf. Um,
Oh, there's some stuff over here. That's me, sweet, I think. Must be. Yep. I wonder if boiled stuff can can go off. I assume this is being sweet as well. Goldenrod. Um, I wonder if there's more of that back there. Because I don't think I need to boil this. It's good both ways, apparently. I would love some more goldenrod. So I'll bring back, let's see, how much do I have? Ah, I have nine stones, I might as well find one more. Retrieve one more. Or three more. No, I'm not swimming it back. Oops. Okay. But I'm not thirsty. Am I going to be able to drink this? This kind of stinks. I wasn't going to say stinks, but... And sorry for all the F-bombs in the uh, two episodes ago. I do try to make this a family-friendly show. Um, sorry for the F. Eat. Uh, I just burped, I think. So, no, don't eat that. And Hmm. You know how I don't like to waste things. If I can go find some more goldenrod, I can use that instead of the meat sweet flowers. Let me see. For least serious wounds, I can also just treat, just rinse, maybe the five least, the skull, the hip, the two in the thorax, and the left upper arm look like, just rinse them. So let's do that. Take off the crudes, give me a weight penalty. Okay. And position. Okay, this one. Clean. Hmm. Uh, physician. Yep. 
quickly and easily. That's what I like to see. Position. Thorax. <clears throat> Position. Thorax. Oh, can I not even consume this out of the pot? I didn't consider that. Do I have to craft like a, a mug? <laughs> I know from experience you can consume food out of a pot, but maybe not in this game, and that's fine. Okay. I wonder if that goes bad. See if we can find more of this goldenrod stuff, though. That would be really good. experience it's fairly unusual to just see one of something without you know without it having a bunch of friends still can't identify that whimsical oops mushroom and don't seem to be having any luck finding more Goldenrod. Hmm. This is mead sweet, isn't it? Yeah. One reason I like tidying up is um, and only around my my camps or my shelters, whatever you want to call them. When you turn your back, like you can't see that that branch when you've got your back turned to it, but you see it now. So it kind of draws your eye and. It's just nice to not be distracted when you're looking for, well, you're just looking for something new. 
You don't want things to draw your eye that are just totally irrelevant. If, if you're looking for prey, if you're looking for a bird or a lynx or a bear or whatever you're looking for, you don't want your eye drawn away by a rock or a twig that, okay, that, that appeared. Now I have to take that split second to identify that. So that's why I often tidy up around my, my camps. Um, maybe I should go looking for herbs in, in neighboring, um, neighboring squares and try to find something I don't need to boil. And in the meantime, I should just keep going with, uh, without any leveled physician again. Yeah, things aren't as good this time. A lot of yellows over there, and only, is that only one that's the right color, this one? Or is dark green good too? Now I can't remember. Anyway, I think that's the only one that's the right color. Um, we got, we don't need that. That and that and those. four kilometers an hour. Even with all of our food. So that's good. Oh, we thought about fishing maybe. But first let's go get our wounds treated by the sage. Maybe do a little bit of, it was the eastern one, I think, that had the sage. A little bit of, this is just more meat sweet, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we're in no shortage of meat sweet. Which is weird, because I never remember seeing meat sweet in my other games. I probably did, but it... I certainly, I saw a lot more nettle and uh, I think goldenrod and various others than meat sweet. <laughs> What's going on? Okay, it's just that damn bird. Hush.
hills and mountains, as I recall, have... I'm a bit tired. I can probably make it to those hills down there and see if they've got anything that that would be useful. I'm not sure if it's hills and mountains, but I just remember nettle growing close to one or the other, or possibly both. Why can't I see what's going on in between here in the village? That's weird. It's all flat, isn't it? Now that I have the new patch, I don't I don't think I need to worry about map maintenance anymore, which is was what was really slowing my roll about this game. So that's uh, comforting, but it hasn't been an issue in this series yet. I think because I haven't traveled a long distance, what seemed to get me in trouble is when I would fully, or not fully explore, but do a lot of ex exploration in one area and then just hit the road and go, you know, halfway across the Finland or three quarters of the way across Finland and then start exploring the other area. But it might have been something else. I don't know the, the mechanics exactly. But apparently that's been fixed. Or at least greatly improved in this patch. Um, where is our friend, the sage? going please heal me okay let's see if that did anything see that looks a lot better I don't see any yellows so this time the sage did something maybe that's what he does he if you totally botched it to where it's a yellow or worse he'll he'll raise it to the lowest level of green? I don't know. That's what it looks like though. Is this a dog pipe? But I don't harvest herbs in the villages. They'd probably get mad, but even if they didn't get mad, I wouldn't want to do it. Um, a bit tired. We're going to make our way over to those hills. Slowly, carefully, not slowly, because it's a turn-based game. I'm actually not going any more slowly. I'm just doing it carefully so I don't encounter yet another Nierpez. What was that? Oh, I could check on an old Nierpez corpse and see if if that one's still there. All right, what have we got here? I believe that's nettle, and I believe I don't know what it is yet, unfortunately, which is annoying because I could really use some. Sorrel. I don't have fevers. Um, and I don't need an increase in appetite. So that stuff's pretty useless, unfortunately. And that's what's over there, too. Looks like it. And this is black currant blueberry. Okay. What's that? This is nettle. I mean this, not 
but milkweed is also helpful. Okay, I think we're in business, so let's look at that. Uh, bingo. So yeah, let's and let's look at nettle. This is nettle. Nine of them. Oh, but we can't harvest it yet. What? Did we leave a bunch of stuff here and never come back for it? That's puzzling. That doesn't look like something I would drop. Did, did an NPC die here? And I'm just stumbling across this stuff. I'll take it. Finders keepers. Unless it's my stuff, in which case keep your hands to yourself, please. I will definitely take that. Let me see what this says. Drop stuff here after killing your pets. I guess... I guess that it, it's too big of a coincidence that I think it is mine or was mine and is again. I guess I killed the New York Pez and I just didn't have enough to carry it all and, and just forgot and never went back for it. So that was negligent of me. Not that this stuff is worth that much, but... Okay, um... I didn't bring my knife. Never not bring your knife. You can probably use an axe to... to let's see what it will do here. Agriculture, harvest... Okay, this is taking some time, but I think it's totally worth it. Harvest. Again, with herbs, I'm kind of like with trees. I don't like to clear cut. Which is a little, well, it's not a little bit, it's, it's role-playing a bit, it's saying. Gotta leave some for, to grow. Okay, milkweed, milkweed. Two milkweeds, five milkweeds.
berries? Raspberries. I think I mentioned before, berries really aren't very nutritious. I'm not going to bother to waste time doing that. I guess just to show you how it works, you just pick. Whoa! I was not expecting that. I guess raspberries work differently than other berries because I've never... Yeah, I did not want to take whatever that was, two hours or something it looked like. So I learned something there when I thought I was sort of demonstrating something. Um, we're weary. I, I really can't stay any longer. Well, I can, but it would, it would be a really bad idea. Um, I think we're going to come back here tomorrow, so we don't need to check on the Nurepes right now. He's over there. Or he should be, but he probably isn't. Yeah, I can make it back, no problem. I might be extremely tired, but I'm going to make it back. Okay. So that was good. Uh, feed the dog. food. Pick up these heroic roasted elk cuts that never went bad. I think there's a there's some RNG on how long these things last because it sure feels like they should be at least stale by now. Ooh. I bet you this last one goes stale before I get to eat it but I'm, I'm quite happy with uh, how that's worked out. I think it's probably been long enough. Uh, sorry for the boring content, but it's what happens when you're severely injured. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.